Hi guys, I'm back again and this is going to be a weight loss, healthy living, updatey kind of thing. Um, so it's been eight weeks since I started and I have lost a total of 7.9 kilograms. So I'm now 122, I was 129.9 when... I started, so it's 7.9 kilos I have lost in 8 weeks, which is ahead of where I was intending to be. I was only sort of intending to be at the most like 123, so um, because I'm trying to do this nice and slowly, I'm not trying to rush it or anything. Sometimes I have to remind myself of that though, because I just think, oh my god, I want to lose weight faster, but it's not going to happen, so I'm not going to do that. It's more about being healthy than anything else. Um, I have, last week I didn't actually lose any weight and it was, I had a really bad week last week. It wasn't that so much that I was overeating or anything, I just had no motivation and I wasn't being as active as I had started to be, um, wasn't really walking my daughter to school and yeah, so... I felt, and the other interesting thing is that I ate chocolate for the first time in like seven weeks, hadn't actually eaten any, and I didn't really enjoy it that much, like it was nice, but I'd kind of rather have something like um, the chocolate date muffins that I've been making that are, um, they feel healthier apart from the fact that they probably are because I don't have a whole lot of extra stuff in them. Um, but it was just, it was like kind of interesting. My taste buds have actually changed. I'd rather have an apple than a piece of chocolate. So, um, which is strange because I love chocolate normally. But anyway, um, yeah, so it wasn't that I put on any weight. It's just I didn't lose any. And then this week I lost like 1.4 kilos. And I don't think I've really been that much more active this week. Um, I might have been watching what I eat just a little bit more. What was interesting is that I've been making these muffins which come from the Julie Stafford um, recipe book and they're, you know, healthier. Like they still have fat and sugar in them but they're supposed to be healthier. Plus they have, um, they tend to have whole grain, like whole wheat flour and stuff in them so they're, they're quite fibre laden and so they kind of tend to keep you, and like low GI, so they tend to keep you full for longer. I didn't make any of those last week and I think that's part of the reason I didn't lose weight is because when I have those I tend to feel like I'm fuller and I don't feel the need to snack or anything and if I don't have them like I eat more of the fruit and nut things that I was like eating which I normally only have a small amount of so I think that was part of where the problem actually was and because I went back to making muffins it kind of went back the other way. Um, yeah, so that was, that's kind of interesting. So it, you know, I am making progress and like, I'm really, really happy about that. Um, now, um, a young lass, she's young comparison to me anyway, um, called Ellie, um, who's here on YouTube. I will actually link down to the video that she posted about this. Um, it's kind of like doing a YouTube collaboration which is kind of like if you want to be involved you can and it's about like losing weight getting healthy kind of thing um and like i'm totally on board with this i love the idea of each other helping you know helping each other achieve our goals and you know it's always good to have someone hold you accountable um so there's supposed to be a hashtag that's that's coming with it um which i don't know what it is yet but I just thought I'd put it out there in this video. Um, if I have the hashtag by the time I put this up, I will include it somewhere around. Um, and yeah, so that's where I'm at. I have made progress, which is really, really great. And I'm thrilled and I can fit back into a pair of jeans I have not worn in friggin' ages. Uh, not that the weather is appropriate for wearing jeans because it is getting hotter here, but it's nice to know that I can fit into them if I wanted to wear them. And yeah, so that's where we're at and I will see you in my next video. See ya.